We have made it to the state of Massachusetts, and today we are going to be playing at Nauset Head, made by Alex Granger. 5.7k plays already, and oh, four and a half stars. How surprising. We are about halfway through <laughs> these National Treasure courses, so we have... Quite a ways to go. I'm going to play through them all. I said I was going to play through them all, and I am going to stick to that word. But for today, we have a par 71, 7,233 yard course set on the coast of Massachusetts. We are playing from the tips, which are white pins for everything that you see on the screen is defaults. So let's head out and see what Alex Granger has in store for us here at Nosset Head. Our view from the first tee, Clubhoff, Clubhoff, Clubhouse off to the right. Let's go take a peek at it. Start off. Nice. Go Sox. <laughs> uh, screw the, screw the Sox. <laughs> oh man, that's good though. <laughs> that was really good. Yeah, looks good. Nice little putting green out here. Good plot of land, too. Right along the coast. Goes pretty deep. Definitely going to be some elevation in play. Definitely some uh, elevated fairway landings, looks like. This is a nice setting right here. I like this shot right here. This course looks good. What is it? Oh, driving range. Like, oh, what is this out here? Driving range. Okay. Got a windmill. I'm probably going to try to hit it with how bad my swing's been. But no, this looks good. This looks really good. This is a cool shot right here. You got to go, go across the bridge to get to your second shot. That's good. All right, I'm excited to see uh, what the golf has in store for us today here. All right, we start off on a par five, 637 yards, 79 feet down. Holy moly. I'm going to do a touch of fade into this. We don't have a lot of wind to work with today. Two miles an hour. We started off with a perfect. Okay. That worked beautifully. What if we're actually, I think we're going to actually be able to go for this. 348 to start. Oh, 23 down. 81 to 84. That's not ideal. I don't know if this, this definitely does not get there though. So we'll try. <sighs> Red fasted it. I would have made it too. Now we're going to play, be playing off to the rough here. Which is okay. I mean, this is playable, especially coming into the screen. But, I mean, obviously. We want something a little bit better than what we just had. <sighs> Thought maybe we were going to make it there for a second. <laughs> <laughs> that's a tough little that's a tough little pin to get to. Just because of the way the sloping works. Alright, let's see if we can drain this to start it off with a birdie. Oh my god. I I shorted it. I needed to hit that so much harder. Like another Two feet past the hole to get through that break and hit center cup. Oh my gosh, we start with a par. That's, oh, that sucks. Because that was the right line. I just didn't give it. I needed to give it a lot more mustard than what I did. Highly unfortunate. I'm going to tell you right now, swing past couple of days has been very bad. I'm trying to work through it, but it has not been going too well. I thought maybe, you know, fresh, fresh go of things. 
fresh go of things, maybe, you know, a little bit of a reset. I'd come back today feeling, uh, feeling it off the start, but... <sighs> Just gotta, I don't know, clutch up, you know? Get those shots. Oh, I actually thought this was gonna be an elevated fairway landing when I was looking at this through the fly fly through. It is not though. Wind's picking up a little bit. This is probably gonna finish rough. This is the fast. Maybe he gets lucky. Do you feel lucky? Punk? It does. It actually didn't roll out as much as I thought it would. That was actually pretty mild of a rollout, honestly. We use that to our advantage over here. Play this slope back to the left. Perfect. All right. We actually got a perfect. Now let's see if maybe, just maybe, we can bury this birdie here. All right, okay. So now I have the blueprint, right? What we just did right there, that's the blue blueprint to birdies. Now, just have to do that, you know, for every hole. Ooh, look at this green. Holy shit. I mean, I'm gonna have to play it off to the left. I, I guess I could go at it a little bit. I don't know. I guess let's try to go at it and see what happens. We great faster, so that's what happens. Oh, this is rolling off the green, for sure. No way this stops. Wow, okay. I mean, I'll take it. Definitely not expected, that's for sure. Three, six, we're going uh, way up the hill. All right, let's see if this bends in. A little too far left. Good try though. We'll clean up the par. Still one under. Not too bad. Definitely, I mean, if we had just a little bit better shots, you know, get that tempo down, definitely would be going a lot better, but... Not, not, not bad. You gotta, you gotta slow down. Saddle. Okay. Just need a perfect. No, I don't want to pitch. Just need a perfect. Coming up the hill. Tight landing zone. Look at that landing zone. Woo! All right. Uh. Oh, no! We suck again! Man. That's just bad. Plain and simple. Eventually, eventually I'll get to the point where my tempo doesn't suck. Maybe one of these days. But, uh, I don't think it's gonna be today. I go through bouts, I'll have a round where it's like, oh my god. This is so good, and then I'll, like, the very next day I'll be like, oh god. This is bad. And then the next day, all perfects. Not all perfects, but a lot better. Then there's days like this where it's just army golf. But as long as we get a nice shot for our approach, you know, we can actually, we can work with that. Come back. 
Damn, dude. All right, we have to make a master class chip here. Got to get it to stop, too. And I slow it. Oh, it's going to get it to stop, at least. That was actually pretty good pacing. That might have been close to going in if I hit perfect. All right, another par save. Not ideal, especially on a par five, man. Still chilling at one under. Keeping bogeys off the board, I guess. You know, to look at the silver lining. That was good. That was exactly where I wanted it. Might actually be good distancing here. Oh my god, dude. Red fast again. Come on. Son of a bitch. Oh my god, I pushed it. That might actually finish. Yeah, it did. That finished in an all right spot to get up and down for par here. What? What? Where was that break at? <gasps> now that's just, that's just mean. Dude, that broke, that broke like three solid inches to the left. Wow. Man, when it rains, it pours. I think I need to be quicker. I need to be quicker on my downswing. I'm gonna try that. Oh, close. We gotta get up and down, though, again. Which we do. Okay. All right. I'm going to try being a little bit quicker on my downswing. I think that might be what it is. It's actually not bad distancing for me. I think that might be what it is. I think I just need to be quicker, like, not hold it at the top as long. Be a lot quicker. That actually rolled back a ton. Holy cow. I need to be a lot quicker on, uh, when I start my downswing. That actually almost drifted enough to miss it right. We get a birdie, though. Okay. Birdie to end the back. That's good. That is very good. And then you hit me with a drivable par four to start the back nine off. Okay. Slight gray fast might actually work to our favor here. That was a great bounce. Oh, baby. Slow down. Slow down, slow down. Don't lose it. Don't, 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 don't. No, stop. Stop. No. Oh no, God. No, God. Please, no. No. You bastard. Dan, it's gone. I can't believe, dude. It rolled all the way. Come on. That's just, that's wrong. And then I do that. Shorted the shit out of it, dude. God dang it. I did it again. I'm stupid. 
What a freaking waste. All right. <clears throat> well, <clears throat> try to recover from that mentally here. At least we're getting good drives now. After I started being a little bit more aggressive with the downswing timing. We got a chance to maybe pop this thing up here. I don't think it makes it, and I definitely don't want to do three wood in. Oh, you want to know the last thing I wanted to do? Put this into the rough, coming up onto this elevated green. Is this, this could be deadly. You know what? I'm going to try to actually roll it back. Ah, didn't get high up enough on the hill, which is fine. Because we have a chance at a birdie again. Which we drain. Okay. Okay. That kind of makes up for number 10. Kind of. Barely. Slightly. Maybe. I don't know. Not really. Ugh, no. That still actually burns me. 19 feet down. Wind is at our back. I don't think we make it there anyways, but we're going to try. We just need 105 perfect right here. I don't even think that makes it, but we're going to try it anyways. How about 102 red fast instead? Does that sound good? Because that's what you're going to get. You know what? 72.79 might actually be all right here. A little short. I hope it grabs. It kind of did. Uh, not enough, though. <laughs> and it's gone. <laughs> God dang it. It was a little too short, and it hit that way too firm. It hit that hill way too firm, and once it did, it was just like, see you later. And we red slow it. Man, come on. I'm shooting myself in the foot right now. Man. Just, uh... In. Breathe out. Okay, I think I might actually have the tempo figured out a little bit here, though. I mean, kind of. So far. In a way. It's probably going to leave me, but... That's feeling good. Off the tee is actually feeling great. That is also good. Oh, where's the distance at? Go. Go. Yes. Okay. Here we are. Give me another birdie on the board. Three under. All right. Back nine. Picking up here. Front nine was, you know, just the warm up. This course has played very well. It's played very realistically. I like that. I like that a lot. That didn't feel good. As soon as I swung it, it didn't feel good. All right, we got to get up and down here. Need a recovery. See if we can do it. A red slow splash. Okay. I really like the greens of this course. They've played very well. Good difficulty. Great prote protection. Because, I mean, we've had a lot of roll-offs. You know, a lot. Of, three roll-offs already. Yeah, it's played very nice. 
Another perfect Dr. T box. Big, big, big fan of those. This has been a really nice plot, too. The elevation has really worked uh, nicely. Especially going along the coast. It's been good. There we go. Oh my gosh, that's about as straight as I can get right there. A little bit shorter than I wanted it. This might work out, though. It does. I'll put us into a nice position right there. Coming back up the hill. Oh yeah, this is good. Four. Six. Alright. I hit a, a touch firm. Not much, but that just didn't break at all. I didn't break it all. Where it said it was going to, it was just straight as a whistle. And I know I was hitting it pretty firm, but usually it grabs a hold of it a little bit. That just did not at all. Nice. Very nice. Distance. Ah. Not bad, though. Not bad at all. Definitely one that I wanted to go at that a little bit more. Like, I wanted to go at the pin just a touch more. Had the right distancing. If that would have just... If I would have put it just a little bit more left. I would have just put it a little bit more left. That might have had a really good chance of uh, being a hole-in-one. Man. I, I just... I haven't been getting the break out of my putts that I think I'm going to. I haven't been getting it at all. It's been really interesting. Like, that felt good, looked good. I mean, I know I, I might have pushed it just a hair, but I don't think it was enough that should have affected it that much. Oh, there's a tree there. Oh, that's, that's mean. I'm actually all right with that. So I just wanted to get it down here, and we did. I probably could have... I probably could have played it, like, to the left of the tree so that we had a shot. But that would have been... That would have been so difficult to actually line up correctly. There's just no point. Especially coming up over this big ravine. Mmm... I have such a big difference i'm gonna try to pop it up into the wind and i read fast it doesn't even matter damn it dude okay we gotta we gotta play the uh the up and down game again and this is a tough shot that we're gonna have to try to get up and down Didn't want to red fast it. I took up a lot of distance. Okay, here we go. So, it hasn't broke as much as I thought it would the past couple of putts, so let's play it. And I short it. Pain! So much pain! What has been my putting today? What has been my freaking putting today? It's been bad. Very, very bad. As we come up to the 18, we got to get that that bogey back. Let's get this back to a three under. This is a great hole to go out on. This is nice. Is that OB? It sure is. I like this a lot. Coming back into the clubhouse. This looks good. We're going to definitely play this uh, safe back with a three one. Uh, this course overall... This course overall has just been really good. Really good sight lines. I, I really liked the stretches along the coast. That was really nice. Elevation was good. The greens were good. The whole setting is nice. Thoroughly enjoyed it.
tough pin to go out on. We gotta get this on the right side of the hill. It gets on the right side of the hill. And it stops. Okay, we have a chance at our birdie here to get this back to a three under. Here we go. Can we drain this? God, I sure hope so. We don't because I hit it super hard. <laughs> Shit. God dang it, dude. I freaking blasted it. Lift off. Not my best rounds. For sure, not my one of my, not one of my best rounds. Two unders where we finish though. And that's NASA ahead. Hit a lot of fairways in regulation. Big fairways though, so that definitely helps. 55% green in regulation. That's pretty bad. But we did score a 69. Nice. So go and get this play. Nasa ahead. Alex Granger. Definitely enjoyed it. And I hope you do as well.